Hello everyone, uh, my name is Donnie Smoke. I am a pastor here at PAC, and this is the house church video for April 9th, and this is an up week. And as I was preparing for this sermon, uh, I was reading the book of Matthew and trying to make things uh, make sense for myself and also to make an impact in the lives of the people here at the congregation. And I had to read it over and over and over just to um, get a good sense of what it meant. And one of the things that I uh, had a question about was, what is Passover? What does it really mean? What were the Jews of Christ's time really celebrating? And they were celebrating a time where we take responsibility for not only ourselves and our community, but the whole wide world. And what did that mean? What to, how do we live our lives in a way that we can be a part of Jesus' team in hopes that we can uh, turn the whole world upside down? As I continued to read into uh, the book of Matthew, I came upon a couple of things that were similar to what we do in terms of uh, uh, First Nations people. We have a lot of feasts and at these feasts what we do is we put out a plate and it's called a spirit plate and that plate is meant to uh, nourish one's spirit as they leave this world and change worlds and it was kind of made me think about communion. So I started to to look into the two of them and, and see the similarities about eating uh, with the spirit. My light bulb moment was that the difference is Jesus um, doesn't ever leave us. He doesn't go anywhere. He's always present in our lives. So that was there were similarities there, but just a little bit of a difference there. As I continue to read the book of Matthew and prepare for the sermon, uh, my arrow moment or my conviction was in the fact that I don't know if I am living my life in a way <clears throat> that really puts me um, as one of the best players on Team Jesus, as the MVP as the one who's gonna step up to the plate and guarantee a win when it comes to uh, spreading the love of Jesus and spreading the gospel. So my challenge this week to the house churches is to take a good look uh, inward and uh, you know, be honest and find out if uh, you really are uh, doing your best uh, for Team Jesus uh, and make sure that you are uh, stepping up to the plate and being an MVP. Uh, in order to make uh, those changes in this world and to do what God wants us to do as Christians. So I just want to wish you all a, a great week and I hope that uh, you have a great conversation at your house churches and uh, peace and grace to all of you. Thank you.